Hello and welcome to this new part of Let's Play Oblivion 2018. Yes, the ultimate modded version of Oblivion. With, of course, the help of the Bevelix guide and some mods of my own. Um, let's see, first of all, I've catched a little bit of a cold, I think. I have a sore throat, so if my voice sounds a little bit deeper than normal, then I apologize. Uh, but then you know the reason. What happened last part? Last part, we went into a horrible cave here. I think it was this one, or the mine. Not really sure. But anyway, we can now go to Skingrad um, to still continue the Mage's Guild quest there. And um, let's see, yeah, and I was thinking maybe if we're going towards the next city, if we finished all the quests in the next city, and that's going to be Anvil, maybe we can do the quest for the Grey Prince in Arena, because if I'm able to uh, win all the Arena fights and eventually... Um, <coughs> There you have the problems of my sore throat, but if I'm able to eventually win all arena fights, I should be able to kill him. And if I kill him, it counts as a uh, NPC kill, and that will trigger the Dark Brotherhood quest line. So that's going to be awesome. But first, let's go towards the um, Mage's Guild and towards Skingrad. And another thing is I disabled the stupid combat overhaul, which... Uh, made the game actually a lot more difficult for me and uh, it also disables the, uh, the, the the walking speed which was um, you know being nerfed a lot and now I'm able to actually walk again finally a normal speed or I should say run at normal speed so I can enjoy the environment a lot better without having to constantly you know walk very slow like that and that's not needed anymore, so we can enjoy more environment. And let's see, we are in this world where it is 1.38 p.m. And that's awesome because it means we have daylight finally. We can travel at daylight instead of always traveling at night, you know. And that's a good thing, so let's check up Skingrad. Um, to be really honest, it's quite a while since I've visited there uh, in any playthrough. And I'm not really sure if I actually ever did a quest there. So that's going to be fun. And uh, let's see what the city has to offer for us. And here are the city walls, so that means hopefully no bad guys are going to attack us. But yeah, <laughs> oh look at that. A rat, a flying rat. Alrighty, um, so let's see where there's an entrance. And while we're here, let's pick some flowers, which we can use for alchemy. A lot of flowers here, a lot of exotic flowers, maybe. All right, let's see, where is the, is there a path here? Look at here, all these exotic flowers, which we can pick. Awesome. There's a path here, so let's just follow the path, and there should be a city gate nearby. Uh, what I remembered from a fully modded Oblivion that for some reason skin grads um, had some effect on the FPS, and I'm not really sure why that is. Um, maybe a lot of actors are being loaded uh, constantly, but... What do you want? For the rest, um... Yeah, for the rest, the uh, FPS should be fine, you know. It should be between 50 and 60, I think. Bye. And let's not to forget... I'm David of Surely Brothers Vineyard. Well, hello. Um, what I wanted to say, let's not forget we're actually overclocking the Oblivion engine with all these mods, you know, with a load of mods, so... Uh, it's always a miracle that my game does not crash. But let's see, we've talked to a brother here from the fine yard or something. Yeah, well, in all honesty, no. But our wines are very good, and much cheaper than Tamika's very fine product, I assure you. All right. Gaston and I make great wines, reasonably priced. Skingrad has two great vintners, Tamika and Cyrilli. I'll never say a word against Tamika's wines. Okay. The West Weald is a good place. Arena Juranus isn't the friendliest person in the world, but not a bad sort when you get to know her. Well, thank you, kind sir. Goodbye. And where are you? the shadows well, fellow Ah, thief. look, a fellow thief. Awesome. Um, what can you tell me about this? Rats? They've got fighters guild people out killing rats? You're kidding, right? I served as a Legion marksman for 20 years. I retired here to Skingrad, work in the vineyards, and supplement my income as an advanced trainer. All right, but you can't train me. Okay, I can't really trade anything with him, which is quite unfortunate. 
but that's fine. Let's see what we have here. I see a windmill in the distance. Maybe we can go there, see what's going on there. I'm Tamika. We grow our own grapes and make fine wines. What can you tell me about this city then? Skingrad's wines are the best in Tamriel. I invite you, try them for yourself. Here, it is perfect for grapes and perfect for wine. The sun and soil here are like my native Hammerfell, but the climate is milder and the rainfall more reliable. Okay. Bye. Bye bye. Let's see, where should we go first? To the city? No, let's just go on an adventure again towards the mill. Not really sure how much of an adventure that is, but. Well, hello. I'm Bernadette Penelis. I work for Tamika. I grow grapes for her wines. Nice. I've lived here all my life. Grown grapes, it's all I know. Fresh air, mountains, the grapes on the vine. It's just beautiful. I agree. I agree, Cyril. a very beautiful continent. Farewell. So let's see here. We have all these vineyards here outside of the city walls, which apparently um, are the major income here. Not really sure. And you can see with these open fields that there are not many trees to cover the pop-up. So that's something we need to live with. But uh, oh well, we're fine, I guess. All right, let's Oops. quick save first. And, and now I'm not really sure if picking this is a crime. There's not a red hand, so probably not. But no, let's not take the risk, shall we? Let's not try to do that. What do we have here? All right. Nothing really fancy. Let's go to the windmill. See if there's anything special there. <coughs> and sorry about that. It's my bloody throat. I'm not really sure um, how long my sore throat is going to keep on, but uh, oh well. Only as an effect that my voice is a little bit deeper than normal, and I sometimes have to cough. So, is there anything special about this windmill? Or is it only been used for production or something? Oh, look. <laughs> Immense of trees pop up. Let's pick these flowers. And what I did also, by the way, is I lowered my mouse speed a little bit. Maybe I can set it even lower. Um, because I had some... Um, you know, some people advised me to be gentle with the movement speed for uh, looking around. Let's see, um, because else it makes it very disturbing, you know, when I move fast like this. So I think, I hopefully this is a good speed. And let's save the innie because for some reason Oblivion sometimes don't save the innie values if you exit in the game. So let's see what this windmill has to offer us. Let's quick save in case. Ah, look, there's a cave there. <coughs> ah, this is the cursed mine, okay. Well, maybe there's going to be a quest for this later, so we're not going to enter this. Not really sure if we're able to enter the windmill. I think we do. Or not. No, it's closed. Okay, that's fine. Alright. Let's go back to the city and see um, what we'll find inside the city. Maybe we can. S uh, we also need to sleep for uh, an hour or something because we're level up. Yeah, the pop-up sometimes can be quite disturbing um, in Oblivion when there are no trees to hide. It's as you can see. Uh, I'm a fair hand at grapes and bows. Shamir grower. And I don't like that Danis Artelian. He's a bit stuck up for my tip. Raymond Broder. He works Surly's Vineyard. I work Tamika's Vineyard. Raymond spent 20 years in the Legion, and he's an advanced marksman trainer. All right, I saw you can train as well. Let's see what he can Knowledge do. Is the key to Marks success. Man. Nah, I don't need that. Bye. I don't need to use my bow and arrows since I got magic to spend. All right. Hello, did I speak All to you already? I'm you need to see Ugar. Okay. I don't know if Tumendil ever leaves the chapel. That man works day and night to take care of all of us. Thank you. So can I enter? Yes, I can. Well, hello. You want a horse? I can sell you one. 
There are no finer bay horses than those sold by the Grateful Pass stables. Look at these scary eyes from the orc. Let's see how, how much does it cost. Our bay horses are faster than the paint horse. All right, so... Nah, thanks. Then I guess you'll be walking. Thousand gold. Okay, that's an acceptable amount. That's an acceptable amount, but um, not not right now. You're new here in Skingrad. Fine. I'll make sure the captain knows we have a stranger in town. Please keep your weapon sheathed and use your best manners. We're a bit suspicious of strangers here. Don't give us anything to be suspicious about, will you please? Sure, no problem. He preaches in Admiral. Appeared right after the attack on the chapel there. Sounds like the usual doomsaying nonsense. I've bought a good number of things at Colovian Traders, and Gunder is a f Okay. Alright, let's go enter. Let's see um, what King Gord has to offer for us. Maybe sell some of my goods, you know. Maybe let's find an armor because I have so many looted weapons and armor. Well, hello. What can I do for you? You look like a mage. Skingrad is the wine producing capital of Tamriel. You must sample our local wines. You'll never taste better. Okay. The 415 vintages were particularly good. The 399, well, a once in a lifetime experience, if you can find a bottle. Well, thank you. Goodbye. Look how big this this city is, by the way, Skingrad. It has um, major um, areas, I think, here. Is there a problem? No problem, sir. I went to the chapel yesterday, but Volandris was the only one there. I figured I'd come back another time. So that guy seems to be alone at the chapel. Poor him. So Skingrad, Skingrad, let's see what the local map has to tell me. Um, seems to be shops here. There's a inn here probably, which means we can sleep. But I suggest we're going to do that when it's evening and we have a quest so we can, you know, spend our adventure if we have one, if we have a quest when it's daylight, you know, so we can sleep till the next morning. All right, let, let's just visit these stores um, to see what they're, uh, what, they're, uh, what they're all about. So this is a tavern, it seems, or an inn. Yeah, looks like it. Cozy fireplace, let's see. So this is actually the... Uh, okay, I think we have to go one level down to this orc. You look I'm Ma Gramogok, proprietor of Two Sisters Lodge. My sister and I own the place. Two sisters, see? Need a bed? Good food? Um, let me tell you, let's... Let's tell a little bit about yourself, what you can... Poor, oh, sorry, I lost my words. Um, tell me about yourself, that's what I wanted to say. I'm not worried about the gates. Well, the guards must have been careless, but Captain Dion has the guard on full alert. We'll be safe. If you say so. Tell me something about yourself. My sister, Ugak Grimogak, runs the Grateful Pass stables. She's the quiet one. I'm the talker. Ah, so that was your sister, that ugly orc. Okay. Have a look at my wares. I'm sure there's something to um, suit you. Let's see, what can I do with these ingredients? Restore fatigue, fire shield. Um, I was I was thinking the other day that um, when I was in that cave where that stupid goblin that shocked me with a staff, I could have just drank or created some resist electricity potions but yeah that's always afterwards goodbye yeah goodbye i'll come later to um to rent a room all right so let's go upstairs and let's see what else there is in this um in this city these are the brothers house um, did we just pass that yeah it seems we did then let's go to the other side. What do we have here? Is this a merchant? The baker's house. No. That's locked. That's probably not a store. 
any stores here, or is it just a uh, residence area? Residence area. Well oh. met, guildmate. Is that you again? You want me? You sure? I'm Vigan. I'm Mage's Guild, but I don't train or anything. Mm. Between the two of them, Borisian and Gaspar have mastered nearly every type of spell there is. You'd be wise to go see them if you can. Sure, I will do that. So what about a recommendation here at Skingrath? Adriana is in charge. You'll need to speak to her about it if you can tear her away from her latest book. Oh boy, okay. Not only has necromancy been banned from practice in the Mages Guild, but the Guild won't deal with anyone who openly uses it. Well, it's a bit rugged. Nothing like the Arcane University. Have to go to the Imperial City to buy anything. But it's good enough, I suppose. Okay, thanks for your time. Bye. So, let's see, what's this? Is this a store, perhaps? Nope. No, only a res uh, residence area. So, let's see, uh, we have a chapel here. I'm Volandra Sabor, primate of Julianus. You may address me as your eminence. <laughs> Thanks for that. I've bought a good number of things at Colovian Traders, and Gunder is a friendly sort. A primate has better things to do than provide tourist information. Beggars have pl You seem like a nice guy. Be seen. Okay. So you Can must be you? the one who is always at the chapel then? Blessings of the Nine. My name is Tumendil. I am the chapel priest. I'm sure you can find your way around the chapel by yourself. The worst thing is, no one even knows what happened. People heard the screams, but when they broke down the chapel doors, everyone was already dead. The church has taken no official position on his teaching yet, but from the reports I've heard, he may be truly inspired by the divines. The Chapel of Julianus is always open for worship and contemplation. Perhaps you should speak to Marie Pallier, our healer and restoration trainer. That's a good idea. So I can learn uh, healing a little bit better. May I interest you in some of my fine wares? Ah, this is a spell. Okay. Um... Yeah. What does he actually sell? Um, yeah, it seems my my restoration skill is not good enough. Okay. Nevertheless, it's still a lot of money, so. Take care. Okay, let's create a new safe as a backup safe. Um, but is there that lady who can train us? Maybe she's walking around to see you. Or is that she? Hello. Ah. Hello. We haven't met, have we? <coughs> I'm Sister Marie Paliella, a chapel healer and trainer in the restoration arts. Good, good, good. Let's see if she can train You've got a lot to learn. Ah, okay. I've reached my training limit, that's unfortunate. The town is very nice, but I advise you to get out and see the countryside. The vineyards and farms, pastures and sheepfolds. Lovely mountain country. bought a good number of things I heard that the town is very nice but I advise you to get out and see okay thanks goodbye that was it I guess so we haven't really got a quest here I'm saving up enough for some med thank you kind sir blessings of Akatosh upon you I'm Dion captain of the skin grad guard Try our wines and cheeses and Salmo sweet rolls. See the castle, but don't expect to see the Count. He doesn't mix with strangers. All right, if you say so. The people have a simple faith in the Nine, and the clerics do their part to heal and comfort them in adversity. Okay. Um, yeah, nothing really fancy happened in this part, um, but we're going to end this part since 
20, 20 minute time limit has passed. Hope you guys liked it and um, yeah, I hope to see you guys at the next part. So take care and bye bye.